Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got MTK Designs from Polish Pickup 2012. Don't let hope become a memory. Maniology M289. I've started off with Baby Girl Lacquer's Glitter Be Gone. And here is Don't Let Hope Become a Memory. Isn't that pretty? I love them flakies. Alright, so we're going to get get going here on this. I, um, I had to look up what MTK was. So, this is, I'm going to call it Miss Mary's Polish. <laughs> this is her brand. And I'm loving it so far. Now, it looks pretty sheer, but let me tell you. This is a thermal, and this is this is how thermals go on. They um, they'll surprise you in the end. I'm sure of it. But they change while you're painting. I mean, you know, while you're brushing it on. It's uh, for me. It's it's I, it's just a funny thing. I just think it's hilarious. But here we go. We're gonna go ahead and do a third coat. And I did three because, like I said, it was changing on me. So, I wasn't sure if I was good at two or what. So, I decided to go ahead and do a third coat. <laughs> Very nice, though. I love those flakies. So pretty. I'm going to top it with INMs out the door. We're going to get this to dry down. You can see it's almost clear, kind of a peachy, pinky clear. And then it changes to like a dark gray. So pretty. Look at my fridge here. There we go. Awesome. I do have a couple of swatch photos coming up. Hi Woody, how you doing? So there's one. The little bit of chip tip change and then the other. Here's Maniology M289. And this is like a fancy French tip stamp and plate. I'm going to clean it with some pure acetone real quick. Get it turned around. I'll be using this um, Fabio Nails stamper today. Bases loaded lacquer on the black. I got my H. La Cosadora scraper out. So I just decided that this would be a fun one to do. You can do these as French tips. You can do them up, you know, closer to the cuticle area. I, you know, just so many possibilities. Of course, for me, it's about trying to get it lined up. <laughs> and I did okay on this, I guess. I mean, you know. I, I know one of them, I got a little close to the tip of the nail. I do hop in with a piece of tape and pull up the extra that got on my skin. And I like this plate because it's got like two different sizes of all the images so you can use like the bigger image on your bigger nails and still have the same image for smaller nails too here we go we'll smush it down okay yeah I cut the tip off of that one a little bit live and learn live and learn all right so now I gotta clean this with some acetone real quick so I can reuse it I'm having trouble Got stuff in my hands and trying to use them still. So here we go. Gonna hop on in here and do this pinky nail. I do use that little piece of tape to get any of the image off the stamper that I don't want on my nails or my skin or whatever. So there we go. Tap, tap. Hop in there with that piece of tape real quick. Easy clean up. So I do clean my plate off with pure acetone before I put it away. I do that with the plate, the stamping mat, and the scraper card. I get all that cleaned up before I put it away. I'm going to top these with the smudge free top coat from Maniology. I'm just going over the part that was stamped. And once that's dry, I'm applying posh top coat. And you can see that's just so pretty like that. I love it. I do have several swatch photos coming up so you can see all the different variants. And there we go. There's a little bit tips there. And then all of it changed colors and then some craziness. Hope you enjoyed it. 
I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.